Hi, I'm Ava Lynn Green with Terry's Yarns and Crafts. In this video, I'm going to show you the basics of how to knit a sweater in the round from the bottom up. This is an example of a small bear sweater, like this one that Mr. Bear is wearing. And to start out, you simply cast on the number of stitches that you need, depending on the size of your sweater. You'll use either circular needles, in the case of this sweater right here, or you'll use double pointeds, which you would have to use for something this small. But you cast on your stitches and you join into a round. And then you start knitting. You knit your, your uh, bottom trim. It can be ribbing or garter stitch in this case. And then just simply work your sweater around and around and around until you get the length that you need to the underarms. When you reach the point for your armholes, you bind off a certain number of stitches to separate your front and your back. Now at this point, I have completed my back. I've worked on up, I've done my back neck shaping, and I have my shoulder stitches, and I have those on a holder. They're ready to be connected to my front shoulder. Now I'm going to take my stitches off the holder and stick my needle through the stitches and turn around and I'm ready then to complete my front neck shaping up to the same point where I have my shoulders done. At this point, you can either use Kitchener stitch or you can do a three needle bind off and connect your front shoulder to your back shoulder, which is what has been done here. Three needle bind off makes an almost invisible seam. I then pick up stitches and do my neck. So this sweater, actually, there are no seams in this sweater. Because I knitted these together, that's the only, only thing like a, sleeve, a seam that there is in this sweater. You can do the same exact design of this sweater for an adult, just casting on more stitches and knitting a longer, a longer time. So that's how you, the basics of doing a sweater from the bottom up in the round. I'm Ava Lynn Green. You can find instructions for this at terryjarnsandcrafts.com.